tell us more about the process for you. Oh, sure. Yeah, no problem. So uh, the day of the accident is pretty much when I reached out to Casey and uh, we, we discussed the case and felt like it was a viable option and uh, it was, we were good to go. So from that point, it was all about treatment because you have to go through all your treatment before you can even start the process of uh, getting an offer and going through the litigation process and whatnot. Um, so that was, a, that was a crazy experience. So I had uh, injured my back and so right off the bat, I went through 12 weeks, I think, of chiropractic services that really helped out a bit but not fully so we uh, went in with uh, three rounds of ster uh, steroid injections in my back uh, and that actually didn't really help out much either unfortunately but at that point um, you know everything was uh, finished the treatment process was good and uh, so uh, at that point we kind of went around and uh, had to collect all the records. Well, I didn't have to do a thing. It was all them. Uh, you know, they, they reached out, okay, who'd you go to? So I went to the ER, which was the only one that I actually went by myself. Chiropractic services and the, and the injections were all uh, per recommendation from them. You know? So when you say per recommendation from us, I just want to make sure that, that it's clear that we gave you a couple of starting points for places you could go for chiropractic care. Right. Okay. But ultimately, did you get to pick what you felt comfortable with? Oh, yeah. No pressure okay. at all. But I'm like, you know, hey, you guys are recommending these people. It's a no-brainer that, you know, they've already got the report built up with this with these providers. Why go anywhere else? And then yeah. the chiropractor, they referred you to additional medical care. They did. Okay. I always think it's important, and I don't know if you agree or disagree, that I never want to push medical care on anybody. I never build up a case just to, to increase the medical because it's right. your body, it's your injuries, and I just think it's so important that you keep control and you keep power over that. Right, definitely. Did, did you feel like that here? Yeah, it was, it was a great great process. Uh, you know, like, of course, I'm, I'm an infantry guy in the military National Guard, so I gotta take care of my back. You know, that's all I got. You know, we carry heavy stuff on our back. That's what I get paid to do. Uh, so I, I needed to, uh, pursue everything that I could to try to get back to 100%.